like the intro. It was like kind of very horror movie-esque. What is going on everyone? My name is Vax and we are back here today with another scary game. This game is called Obsidio, I think is how you should say it. Uh, this is another ghost hunting paranormal exorcism game. You can play co-op. It says that you'll be able to go up to four players, but right now you can only play with two. We play as priests going into a house and figuring out what kind of ghosts we're dealing with and exercising it. It's pretty much just like Ghost Hunters Core and Phasmophobia type of deal. But this game is only $10 at the moment, so it's not a big investment if it's bad. I don't think that this game will be better than Phasmophobia by any means, but spe well, especially with the new update, which I just did a video on if you want to check that out. It is pretty awesome. All right, everybody. If you enjoy this video at any point, and if you want to help this channel out, consider hitting that thumbs up button, maybe hitting the big red button below, and comment if you would like. Tell me what you think about this game. Tell me what game you think is the best ghost hunting game out of the three I just mentioned. I would be surprised if anyone said anything other than Phasmophobia, but everyone has their own opinion. Okay, well, let's go and hunt some ghosts. Let's see if we die. Okay. Oh, shit. Whoop. Okay, we're in a room. Can we watch TV? Ooh, I, I turned on the TV. Got a nice little uh, cat picture here. What the hell is this? Magazines? What the fuck are we wearing? We're priests. Oh, yeah, dude. Which is kind of cool. I mean, this is like the exorcist, the exorcist, I guess. So, we can play Potts Road, a small three-bedroom house with two living rooms and two bathrooms. It's a small house with two living rooms. That's pretty wild. Okay. Uh, River Road, a small rundown three-bedroom, two-bathroom house with a small basement. Or Farm Lane, a large three-bedroom house. And the rest of it's cut off. Something. Bathrooms, living rooms, something. Huge basement. Um, Let's go. To this, this Potts Road looks like a nice house, so let's go there. Hard. So hard mode was checked. I'm gonna leave it checked. <laughs> Fuck it. Oh. You're all set up. Radio me, and when you want to leave. I know this looks like we're in a little girl's room, but she's a chain smoker apparently. All right. So, ooh, we have a first aid kit. All right. I'm on my way. Oh no no no! Shit! I think I just picked to leave. Oops, okay, let's do that again. So don't click on the radio. I was trying to pick up the first aid kit. You're all set up. Radio me and when you want to leave. Okay, so can we hold more than one thing? Dude, that's the doll. No, that's the doll literally from trenches. If you would like to see the doll, go and click on my trenches video. Okay, little plug. Uh, shit, did I pick up? There wasn't... What the hell? I grabbed this EMF and then I had a thermometer. No, you must be able to switch. Oh, okay. I have it still. Why is my guy just walking in place? What the fuck is going on here? Okay, fuck it. Ooh, it's dark. Okay. So, it, if we get hunted, I don't know if we have to go into that room. What the hell is that? I found a little dinosaur, I guess. Ooh. Closet. Can I hide in here? No. So, I don't know if we have to, uh, like, hide if we start getting chased. Well, I don't know if we have to find some clues, man. Oh, nice. I like the mirrors in here. They're just white. Can we turn on lights? Oh, no. I think we have to find the fuse box, even though the light... I mean, the light is on. 
the fuck was that? that was Even though the light is on in the room that we started in. Yeah, probably. Uh, yeah, this is kind of a big house, huh? Oh, wait a minute. Uh, it was pretty cold here for a second. Like right here, nine degrees. Doesn't say. I would assume Celsius. Uh, oh look, this is like Advil. I like how you just like you like you're using your Jedi mind tricks to fucking hold the EMF reader up in the air. Oh. Oh man, it's cold in the basement. I don't know if it's just because we're in a basement or if it's because this is haunted. Have you, okay, cool. So, um, did you shut it off? Okay. What the hell was that? Yeah, it was like a broken broken plate. Oh, there we go. Alright, well, we can look in the rest of the house real quick. And Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think it's in this room here. I was. Oh. <gasps> Why is it red? Are we are we getting hunted? I don't think I can run. Oh. Uh oh. This guy's chasing me. No. No. Oh my God. Dude, that guy. He just. Rip my head off. He, uh, my head is facing the other way. That was kind of creepy, though. I'll give it that. I like the animation, though, with the uh, killing. He, like, lunged at me. Then he spun my head around. Okay, so I seen what room he, he came out of. It was, like, the room right to the left from... Yeah, broken plates are in here. There's a radio. I got someone's cell phone, dude. What the fuck? It's pretty wild. Oh, shit. Maybe. Oh, shit. Yeah, I can open doors and stuff. That's pretty sweet. Alright. That was me. <laughs> dude, while well, I was locked in there, I can't see doors, though. Here, I'll watch, I'll watch him. And, not right now. So he's, I think you're good. See, but there was, there's a bloody knife out in the kitchen and a broken plate, so I thought he was out here. Well, this is kitchen slash living room. Bunch of broken shit out here. So to begin the exorcism, you need to place, oop. Yep, yeah, yeah, run. Tell you, okay, I see him. Oh, dude, he has like a, he's got like a skull face, and he's, he's real jacked. Oh, shit, he's running. Yikes. Radiation true. Ghost orb false. So I was saying what, oh, he was a Yuri. Okay. Yeah, so when you hit J, that's the ghost clues, so you just have to check which one's you have and then you have the exorcism okay so we have phantom shade wraith gin poltergeist chimera fiend uh rusalka yuri mare demon banshee revenant oni effigy shudder i like that there's some extra ghosts oh sweet and then there's a a ghost wiki so it tells you what is the most common Holy water and a rune will exercise an effigy. Common flick light switches, turn on off radios, turn on off alarms, knock books off bookshelf, blow out candles, throw knife is an uncommon one. Holy shit, stab a wall. <laughs> Shring ukulele. Unring a mobile. You're all set up. Radio me and when you want to leave. Come on, give us one right next to the... When I get in this bathroom again, that would be sweet. No. It's not like he just fucked with something. What the fuck? He's fucking around. 
smelling something in this bathroom. Can I talk to you? Yep, ghost orbs in this room. Hold on. Uh, let me put this book down. I, th I don't. It doesn't say that it has to be five. Uh, I don't think you can get anything other than five. You just have to walk around. So EMF, spirit box, ghost orbs. So far. I'll grab the REM pod and I'll grab the music box. Music box. Yeah, I don't know if the REM pod. No. Okay, so radiation. Uh, I don't know if we got the REM pod yet. Uh, we didn't get ghost writing yet. Music box, freezing temps. So we need to see if we get the REM pod and ghost writing. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna turn. I'm just gonna grab it and bring it out of here. Okay, so access some steps. Turn off the breaker of the house, find the doll hidden somewhere in the house and place it by the Bible. Everyone in your team needs to be take anti-radiation pills, place a REM pod within three meters. Make sure all the radios are off in the house and you have to have the heart rate above 140. So I don't know if it could be, it could probably be in a drawer. Oh God. If he comes in here and kills us, this is bullshit. in the basement. Do we look in all the rooms? Did you look in this room? Could it be behind like furniture? I don't know. I'm looking in the basement. Oh, well, hold on. I'm gonna look out the front door. No. I don't think it would be out there. Besides, like right by the door. Oh, motherfucker, dude. side of the room. I don't know, we must have missed it. Is it in the room that's haunted? I don't know how 
well it could be hidden. You turn the TV on? Oh shit, a soccer ball's moving over here. What the fuck is that? No, I'm in the living room. Kitchen area. It's in the trash. Oh, god damn it. Oh, god. Oh god, I think he's near me. He's walking away. I'm alive. Uh, what the fuck? <laughs> Right into the brick wall. Damn, that. Uh, that knife must be made out of fucking titanium. Well, I think this is classified as blood writing. Oh, mobile phone's ringing. Well, I don't think we can actually find them. Maybe it's our mobile phone. I don't know. found it. It's on the side of this fucking sink. Yeah. Tack. Oh, I... Bastard. Devil. Okay, so we need to turn off the breaker of the house. We have to take our radiation Devil. pills. We have to put the doll Devil. next to the Bible. Devil. REM pod next to the Bible. Devil. Make sure all the radios Devil. are off in the house and make Devil. sure your team's heart rate is above 140. Devil. It's over. Down. Yeah, up. but I don't understand like what you God do after dead. you place everything down. Okay. Look so we need what do we need again? You. Holy shit, I forgot. Here. Doll, pills, REM pod. Did the breaker flip again <laughs> since uh, we turned it on? Is here. It's over. Yeah. On the ceiling. On the ceiling. Is yeah. Here. Yeah. So it's over. put the shut the fuck He's up. Here. God is devil. I'm watching. Devil. So now what? Is he, a is he exercised? shade requires holy water and candle but he didn't move any kids toys and I didn't see a rocking chair oh so then that's what okay well ring mobile phones the camera turn on off TV turn on off kettle rock rocking chair turn on off oven blood writing flick light blood and kitchen sink ring alarms ring mobile phones but I don't know okay so so, okay, so if it's the Camara, who's fixing the is that? What the fuck? Yeah. Is that a Camara thing? and possessed 
You won! Woo! True, 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 false, false. Okay. Alright, everybody, and that is Obsidio. I hope I'm saying that right. It sounds weird. It reminds me of like Suit Suit Studio. You know, Phil Collins. I don't know. I'm dumb. Okay, um, yeah, so this game is kind of cool. I mean, it has cool things in it. I like that there is a lot of things that the ghosts can do, like raining blood or filling tubs with blood or stuff like that that you don't really see. And there's a there's a long list, like killing house plants or, or filling a room with flies. So, I mean, that part is pretty unique. I don't know if I would say this is better than Ghost Hunters. Ghost Hunters core seems like it might be a little more polished than this, but it's not it's not too bad. And I, th I, don't, I don't remember what Ghost Hunters actually goes for. I know that when I played it, and talked about it, I said it was more expensive than Phasmophobia, which I thought was a big mistake. But this game is cheaper than Phasmophobia, but not by a lot. So, I mean, if you were in the market for a paranormal hunting game, I would definitely go with Phasmophobia over this. Unless you wanted to exercise ghosts, then Phasmophobia does not have that. If I was gonna rank the three games, I mean, Fast and Phobia would be number one. I don't know. I think probably Ghost Hunters Core would be two, and then this. But I mean, this game, it, this is like day one. So, I mean, a lot of things can change. Hopefully, they will. And we will see more things added to this game. All right, everybody. Until next time, my name is Vax, and I'll see you soon.